Hey guys, today we're going to be looking at the gaming performance of the AMD FX4300 Overclocked. So let's get into it. Welcome to Tech for Today. Alright, the first thing that we are going to do is look at my overclock in the BIOS. As you can see, I have the CPU up to 4.7 GHz and I've overvolted it 1.4 volts. And just to get out of the way, I'm running the FX4300, an MSI 970 gaming motherboard, an NVIDIA GTX 750 Ti, and 8GB of RAM. And yes, I did stress test this overclock for around 8 hours, so I do know that it is stable. Now let's move on to the reason you came here. Gaming. The games that we will be testing include CSGO, The Crew, Dead Space 3, and Grid Autosport. My settings for CSGO include a 1680 by 1050 resolution, all high settings with motion blur enabled, and anti-aliasing set to 2x MSAA. Here is the gameplay, and as you can see, frame rates stay above 100 most of the time. In the crew, we are running at 1680 by 1050 with a high video preset, which sets some settings to ultra and others to high. And as you can see from the gameplay, we are running at around 50 frames per second. In Dead Space 3, we are running at 1680 by 1050 with all of the effects on and high. And as you can see, Dead Space 3 runs well into the 70s. Last but not least is Grid at Autosport running at 1680 by 1050 with a high video preset. And as you can see in Grid at Autosport we're staying in the high 70s. In conclusion, overclocking the AMD FX4300 allows you to go from low slash medium settings to medium slash high settings at resolutions of 1080p or less. Let me know what you thought of its performance in the comments below. I was fairly impressed for its cost. And as always, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and subscribe to my channel as it really will help me out. Thanks for watching guys.